before that, because Murray was an outstanding sports writer with the Long Island Press. And I grew up in Valley Stream on Long Island. And uh, when I was nine years old, I was delivering the Long Island Press, and then I continued that until I was about 15 and moved to um, Miami. And uh, fortunately, because I met my wife at the Miami Jackson High School in Miami, and on um, this Thursday, we're going to celebrate 51 years of marriage. So, but this isn't about me, this is about Murray. And, You've read some of the things about him, how he's a professional harness racing writer and was an outstanding writer, and you see him with some of the people, uh, the New York Knickerbocker players and uh, Joe Namath with the Jets. He was an outstanding writer. But, and he was very professional, very friendly, and a, he was really a nice guy. And I don't think there's anything better to say about somebody then they were a nice guy or a nice girl, a nice woman, etc. But Murray was outstanding. And my wife and I were fortunate enough to know Murray for so many years with Marilyn. And Marilyn was a wonderful woman. And they had a great love affair for a lot of years. And I'm very sorry that we missed uh, Marilyn all, all these days. But I was fortunate enough to also get to know other members of the family. I just met Karen today for the first time. But Donna and I worked together at the New York Jets, and Craig worked for me in the press box at Shea Stadium. And then he went on, to, of course, to be a director of ABC's Monday Night Football for many years. So I just wanted to say it's great to see Murray, and I understand from everybody that he's still very sharp, and he's still writing, and um, we're so happy to be here today to celebrate the accomplishment of his 100th birthday. Murray, happy birthday.